errands done. area is closed so I suppose I'm just gonna do one night here head out in the morning I'm freaking tired some uh, tuna burgers for dinner tonight it is 11 o'clock p.m. and I'm going for some tuna fish so this is uh, what I like to do, if I haven't shown this yet, I think I have. But for those who haven't seen, I like to make these tuna burgers. With coleslaw, use one can, split it in half after mixing some mayonnaise in it. Kind of make tuna spread like you normally would for a sandwich, and then just divide it in half. I put a slice of this uh, Colby Jack, I think is what that's called. A good amount of coleslaw, as much as I can get on there. Do a little more foliage on your burger there. Tuna burger. And some ranch on the top. Kind of makes like a salad on the top and a sandwich on the bottom. I don't know. It's good. I like it. Oh, and I always put the uh, garlic salt on the top of the tuna spread before I add the coleslaw. Then we add the top bones. For a side, I like to have a, a whole pickle. Or even better, some sauerkraut. And there you go. Two tuna burgers. Alright, good morning. It's 7 o'clock-ish. 7.20. I'm going to get on the road early. Go ahead and shut down the diesel heater, and let's go see what uh, where the fuel's at on that. Still have not filled it up yet. Pretty chilly this morning. Not freezing yet, but pretty cold. Should have filled that up before tonight. We can probably go another night or two, but I don't want to run it. Uh, I got my errands done and I just drove past the 
digital sign that says the rest area is closed from this, uh, from yesterday until tomorrow. It will be open tomorrow. Or the last day it will be closed it will be tomorrow. Um, so we're gonna. S I don't know. Maybe drive north to the next one. street with a bunch of RVs on it so I actually might turn around and go over there but first I, I do need groceries so it's awesome there's a good wheel over there too but uh, let's get groceries first and stay over here first looks like we got a you best. RVs on it so looks like the uh, city isn't cracking down too hard on people parking on their streets which is awesome kind of makes sense more things to worry about right now um, but uh, yeah I think it worked out pretty good having the rest areas closed down found me a new spot oh I'm so ready need to remember to turn that off All right, the binds are up. Got some privacy. Ready to lay down and take a nap. I'm freaking tired. 
but I'm hungry. It's 8.40. 8.50. And I have not eaten yet today, so I'm gonna get out some of these hard boiled eggs and play a game on my phone, I think. I'm keeping the generator off for right now. I'm tired of hearing it run all freaking always. Alright, I got a pretty good nap in. Go ahead and Put the rest of the diesel out of this can into the diesel heater. Oh, I smell McDonald's. That smells pretty good. Tank empties out. I got one more I can go open up. Alright, this one is for the rear diesel heater. It's got the little hole I put into it for a, a vent so it could drain. Filled up. Ready to go for the next 40s or so. Diesel. Uh, I'll figure out what I'm doing now. Patch is still looking good. The uh, patches on patches. No roof leaks. No leaks underneath it, I don't think. The drain plug seems to be holding. I did, I did get some seals, I might have already mentioned that. Alright, I think I'm going to run in and get some shopping done before I start up the Jenny and the heater. Save on the fuel, on the gas, and uh, I need to get some work done on the PC. going to have a quick breakfast before I get going. I think I went to bed without eating anything. I mentioned uh, wanting to. Oh, I was going to eat some, I just kind of... Laid down and passed out. It's looking at that, that bus over there. It's like a brand new bus. All the seats are still in it, but he's got a grocery cart out there. I can see him kind of doing something in there. Okay, he's working on his on his new home. I wish I could get a bus. Not that I don't love patches, but I would love to have a bus with that all metal siding or all metal walls. A little more durable diesel. It'd be fun. Alright, let's go for a little walk here. We're gonna check out this goodwill. I have this idea that they might still sell boob tubes there from people just dropping them off, but I don't know, we'll see. I did kinda doubt it. This looks kinda like a trail.
nice. And no rain. This place must be pretty good. So yeah, it looks like this parking lot's got people living in it. Oh, there's an RV, or maybe that's that street I was looking at coming in. Yeah, I saw that street driving by. There's a few RVs over there. Let's just take a quick peek over here and see how it's looking. Yeah, a couple RVs. A semi truck. Location number two. If the man, uh, manager comes out and has me leave, I'll come out. Just come over here. This is like a big item section. Yep. Boot tubes, not so much. Oh, big TVs though. Alright, no boob tubes, but uh, pretty nice store, big one. If I had some extra cash, I'd get some. Give me a couple more t shirts, maybe a. Uh, Pair of pants. See that homeless camp walking by. That's pretty stealthy. Pretty clever, hidden in the bush. I am loving this weather right now. It's, I mean, it's not warm, but it feels warm compared to the last couple of days. It always feels good stocking up on food during these times. You never know when you're gonna go in and shelves are empty. Just stocked up on the basics. I don't have too much money. I'm trying to save a little bit for gas. I'm trying to always keep a little bit set aside for gas since that generator is... Should have put the solar money into gas. I'd have gas for years or maybe months, but 
no i like the solar i'm glad i put it in it just doesn't do crap out here in the pacific northwest broccoli pre-cut i don't know why i grabbed the pre-cut it's a little bit more expensive do you think it's coleslaw too bad carrots this is my main makings right there broccoli carrots coleslaw sometimes i'll change it up and add some cucumbers or cauliflower or celery right now i'm just keeping it easy with some english muffins the good kind of ranch frozen sausage patties for the english muffins for my breakfast some shredded cheese to go on those burritos and some canned goods i got four of these chilies tuna 50 bucks is 46 dollars and 75 cents all right generator is up and going the 2000 security system is powered up about to boot up this command center and get to some work i need to go back and reconnect that big jenny it needs to be run it's been sitting for a while need to run it do an oil change and then start keeping track of hours like i'm doing with everything else now i don't know why that was so hard for me to do before just put a little note oil change on the rv at ninety three thousand one hundred eighty eight. predator 2k oil changed at 730 hours it will need to be changed here in about 100 hours for approaching 1000 hours on the 2k generator uh and i need to take that apart and work on it right now because the pull string is looking frayed like it's about to snap i should look that up on get that ordered maybe they'll probably find that at a hardware store some pull string yeah i bet you i could go to ace hardware find me some pull string and make a note for that because that that does look like it is about to snap any minute now All right, you guys, I just found me a boob tube. Contacted him, he wants a six pack of Sierra. What did he say? He wants a six pack of Sierra Celebration. He, he said, I said, uh, what do you want for the boob tube? And he said, six pack of Sierra Celebration and it's yours. So I gotta go buy some beer. It's gonna be weird. But I don't care. That works for me. Six pack and uh, give me a new boob tube. Big one, 32 inch. He says it takes two people to carry it. It does look big. I'll make it fit. I like it. It looks awesome. Oh, I'm gonna go into Portland to get it though. Yikes. Big yikes. parking lot so I'm over here fueling up the Jenny 